Hello YouTube, hello NFL fans, hello Bear fans. I gotta make this short and quick because man, my computer is just acting up so bad. You won't believe it. It's the fourth time I'm trying to record this. Alright, the wind's blowing, the laptop moves and it quits recording. Okay, way to go defense. Way to go defense. Two interceptions, one fumble, two sacks on a 27 degree day. You know... Normally on a 27 degree day before, uh, I mean under freezing, there's normally 20, 21 points, 24 at the most. You guys scored 20, uh, what, 45 points between the two of you. And uh, amazing. Both teams. I tell you what, I give Minnesota the, the, um, the kudos, man. They played an honorable game. But they are no longer the kings of the north. Therefore, they are called the non-kings. The purple soda non-kings. They are no longer kings. They are the non-kings of purple soda. That's right. They're going to go home with their tail between their legs. You know why? They rushed for 22 yards. Okay, that means all four of their running backs and their quarterback <laughs> didn't go nowhere. They, they, we broke a record. I don't think no team has ever scored... 20 points and didn't rush for more than 22 yards. Frank Tarkenton used to rush for 22 yards on one play. Oh my goodness. Way to go, Bears. Shut it right down. Shut it down. And then, what? We gave up 262 yards of, uh, of, uh, um, to K Kirk Cousins, but, uh, it was this garbage time. You like that? <laughs> I like that. All right, yeah, um, Mitch, Mitch, listen, you ran for 43 yards. I appreciate it. Good job. But instead of throwing those two interceptions, which is Jay in the ball, you jayed the ball twice, Mitch, twice. Quit Jay in the ball. Mitch, you're not going to win no championship if you don't if you don't quit Jay in the ball. I'm telling you. You ran for 43 yards. Why didn't you run for another 43 instead of Jay in the ball twice? That's why they got back in the ball game, Mitch, because you jayed the ball. We ran for 148 yards against that powerful Minnesota Vikings defense. We tore them up. We beat them down. I told you it was going to be a beat down just like we beat down Detroit. It's, God knew it. We held them to 22 yards. That's just amazing. You ain't going to beat up George Hallis' army. This team is George Hallis' army. I'm telling you. And they play at Soldier Field. And they are the kings of the north. Not no non-king purple soda. No. Purple soda non-kings. That's not going to happen. All right. Um, listen, a little tidbit to tell you guys about. When Before the game started, uh, Mitch was ranked 19th out of 89. 89 quarterbacks have held the position of uh, quarterback for the Chicago Bears. 89. Mitch, before the game, was ranked number 19. I'm not kidding you. In one year, in a couple games, he has all the way moved all the way up to 19th all-time passer in Bears history. I'm serious. Right, right above him, which he probably passed during the Minnesota game, Bobby Douglas, Jack Concanon, Kyle Orton, Jim Miller, George Blander, Rex Grossman, Vince Evans, Mike Tomsack, Rudy. Bukic and Johnny Lujak is ranked number nine. Johnny Lujak, number nine. He spent four years at the Bears. He's got 6,295 yards in four years. Hell, Mitch is going to get that by the end of the season. The rules have changed, people. And guess what? Mitch is already the 74th all-time Chicago Bear rusher with 568 yards. He's already ranked 74th all-time. 568 yards, that's just as much as Curtis Anus or Cedric Benson got in a single season. <laughs> Can you believe that, man? Unbelievable. Mitch, if you don't jay the ball, Mitch, you're a champion. You got to quit jaying the ball, Mitch. You got to quit jaying the ball. Did you hear them fans on Sunday night, man? They were roaring. Those fans were bare roaring, man. I tell you what. Shout, shout, let it all out. These are the things I could do without. Come on. I'm talking to you. Come on. <laughs> they gave you life. 
And in the end you gave him hell, as cold as ice. I hope we live to tell the tale. I hope we learn to shout, shout. That's right, that's right, that's right. I'm going to do it, man. I'm just having fun with these videos. Y'all just going to have to put up with me. All right, we're going to uh, the, the toilet, Michigan, on Thanksgiving. We're going to carve up the lion and feast on some lion. We've been there before. The Bears have played on Thanksgiving 34 times. We are 17, 15, and 2 all time on Thanksgiving. That's a winning record, folks. And I'm telling you, man, that's a winning record. It's hard to beat someone at their own place on Thanksgiving Day. We're 8 and 7 at Detroit. And in the last 10 years on Thanksgiving Day, Detroit is 1 and 9 on Thanksgiving Day. All we got to do to beat them, the same way we did last time, hold their Johnson down to the ground. And we can win that ball game. Just got to grab a hold of Johnson and hold it to the ground. Don't let him up. And you win that ball game. I'm telling you. They play with their Johnson. All right. Uh, let's see. Did I cover everything? Wow. Just don't jay the ball. Just don't jay the ball and you'll win. You understand what I'm saying? We got a defense that stops and an offense that can't be if you don't jay the ball. And they are who we think they are. They are who we thought they were. These are the Bears. The Monsters of the Midway. George Hallis Army. Y'all don't forget it. Now listen. Detroit uh, Lions is a scratched cat right now. Okay, they're clawing. They're four and six. They're trying to... I don't know what the hell they're trying to do. But the Panthers gave them a win last year. I mean last week. The Panthers just go ahead and give it to them. <laughs> they didn't even earn it. The Panthers give it to them. So they think they're cocky right now. And they think they're going to get back and ask for what we did to them too. No, no, no. It ain't going to happen, man. The toilet, we're after your butt. We're coming to get you. Happy Thanksgiving, everybody. And uh, uh, enjoy the game. Happy Thanksgiving. Go Bears. Bear down. And I think I covered everything. Don't jay the ball. Don't jay the ball, guys. Oh, I hate them reporters. You know, the reporters ask the stupidest questions at press conferences. How did you feel when you completed the pass? What? Idiots, man. I tell you what. If I was in... Man, I, if I was Jay, I, I mean, if I was Mitch, I'd carry me a squirt gun to the press conference. When they ask, they ask a stupid question, I'd squirt them with a squirt gun. I'll uh, tell you what, man. I think I covered everything. Yeah, man, I did. Seven minutes of your time. Sorry. Go Bears. Bear down. I always try to make you laugh a little bit and sh tell you a little bit of knowledge. Knowledge is good. <laughs> you know what? I'll tell you what. These Bears are unbelievable. Enjoy this season, man. This is a historical, historical season. This is going to go down in the in the Bears archives. I'm telling you, man. I'm glad you're enjoying it. I'm glad you get to see it. Uh, uh, just bear down. Go Bears. Bear down. Beat Detroit. In thanks in Michigan. Happy Thanksgiving. Bye.